In a world of evolving cybersecurity threats, embedded printer security features are more important than ever. These features recognize that firewalls and other basic device protections are insufficient against the latest hacker strategies and tool sets. After all, it only takes a click for malware to attack a network. And since devices like printers are generally not being monitored by security, they're a great place to hide. You may know that HP has the world's most secure printers, but it's important to understand what these embedded layered features are doing. And it can be hard to visualize when all the action happens within the printer's software. So today, we're going to demonstrate one of those features called HP SureStart BIOS Protection with Self-Healing. Hackers can physically disrupt the BIOS by injecting malware into the printer or altering the BIOS code. Now ethically, we can't hack a competitor's device, so we're going to use two HP MFPs, one with and one without the feature, along with a computer screen to watch activity during initial boot up and to observe any reaction from the MFP itself. So let's see what happens starting on the device without HP SureStart. Let's turn on the device and let it begin booting. You can see on the control panel that the hacker has interrupted the boot sequence and has entered the BIOS. The computer screen shows that the hacker is injecting the malicious code. Looking at the control panel, however, there's no visible defensive reaction, which means the BIOS can continue to load and the malware will persist even after multiple reboots of the machine. This is the worst case scenario. The injected malware is now inside the printer and going about its business and no one knows it's happening. Without BIOS protection, this malware will remain dormant during BIOS load, creating a persistent, undetected threat for weeks, even months, able to wreak havoc during runtime of the printer. This BIOS level malware will persist even through multiple reboots of the device and remains hidden on the hard disk of the printer, regardless of how many times the firmware is refreshed. Not good. Now, let's test the device with HP SureStart BIOS protection. Again, as the device is booting, the hacker has remotely interrupted the boot sequence and entered the BIOS. Looking at the computer screen, we can see that the hacker is injecting the same malware code as before, but this time, the control panel immediately shows that malware has been detected. We can hear the screeching halt of the scanner returning to its original ready position, while the machine sends a syslog error message that feeds the organization's threat monitoring system to alert the security team. You'll also notice that the printer is self-healing as it reboots, so that HP SureStart can check the BIOS and automatically reload it from a golden copy isolated inside the printer. Next, the firmware will be compared against a whitelist of approved HP signed versions. These checks happen every time the printer is booted up. Now the printer is back to the same state it was in prior to the attack. There was no disruption to users, no service call, and no need for the IT administrator to be involved. With no BIOS protection, a malware attack would require physical IT intervention to reload the BIOS manually and get the MFPs back up and running, one device at a time. But not with HP SureStart BIOS protection. At boot load and runtime, the printer comes back to a secure runtime state without IT intervention. This ability to detect, protect, and automatically recover is unique to HP. Only HP has SureStart BIOS protection to automatically recover from BIOS level threats, a feature that goes above and beyond the standard security available on most printers. For multi-layered protections designed for today's evolving threats, HP is the only choice.